Don't let this happen to you. Every three seconds in the United States, someone is killed or injured. Of those that die, one out of every three dies in a traffic accident. Don't take a chance <laughs> on tires that blow out. You don't even need a blowout to have a serious accident. On a perfect highway or city street, within legal speed limits, emergencies can always happen. <laughs> Don't take a chance on tires that won't stop you in time. Today you are faced with two developments that literally force you to demand better than average tire protection. More and more high-speed, high-powered automobiles. More and more traffic traveling on more high-speed city thoroughfares and highways. Add to these two conditions the other great demands made on tires today. Within a tire lifetime, it must hold up the weight of a car. Stand in snow till frozen. Be driven at high speeds over highways so hot they'll fry an egg. Jammed against curves. Plunged into sharp-edged chuck holes. Spun. Skidded in stone and gravel. Mistreated some way every day. And yet how important tires are. Here is a $5,000 automobile. Take away the tires and what have you got? Nothing but a high-priced stationary engine. For a small percentage of the cost of the car, it becomes a luxurious means of personal transportation. But what do you know about tires? How much can you tell by looking at them, especially after they're on the wheel? We have safety checks for lights, for brakes, for horn. But the tires, the most important thing on your car as far as your safety is concerned, how do we check them? This one looks all right, a lot of tread still on it, but is it the kind of tread that will stop you quickly? How do you know there isn't a break inside there that might have come from a bump a hundred miles ago? The kind of breaker. This happens in tires that two minutes before looked perfectly all right. What is your best assurance against unseen tire trouble? Here it is. The General Nigen tubeless tire, the one perfected tubeless tire. And here is the famous four-way protection you get only on these brilliant new masterpieces of tire engineering. First, protection against blowouts, because the new General Nigen tubeless tire is built with Nigen cord that is pound for pound stronger than steel cables, as shown in this test lifting a 22-ton truck. Second, Protection against punctures with the exclusive general puncture sealing compound as shown in this cutaway of the tire. Next, this big exclusive, the safety pressure lock with this built-in O-ring that forms a leak-proof pressure lock at the rim when the tire is inflated like this, assuring no air loss. And fourth, quick stopping protection on dry or wet pavement with general's exclusive cross-tread squeegees for fast, straight-line stops as proved in this dramatic test. First, the world's greatest stopping power. Here is a wide pavement reserved for this official test. Five cars will come down at abreast, all the same make and model, and all being driven by test drivers. The only difference, one car is equipped with general tires, the other four with leading competitive tires, which we shall call A, B, C, and D. At the end of each test lane is the wooden cutout figure of a running boy, the kind sometimes used to mark school zones. The pavement has been wet to make it slippery. The signal to start. Here they come, picking up speed, till they are traveling near but not exceeding the legal limit. The signal for the brakes. Now watch. One on Generals came to a quick, straight-line stop. The running boy in front of it was safe. The others were not so lucky. The car on tires A stopped just as it hit the boy. B tires ran over its boy. The cars on C and D tires knocked the dummies galley west. 
Of course, we all face emergencies when we have to drive fast. I say again, why take a chance on tires that will not stop you in an emergency? <laughs> Now for a comparison of strength. Here comes a car on ordinary tires. It's a smooth street. Whoops, he made too wide a turn. The front tire hit the curb. That was quite a jolt. But when the driver anxiously looks the tire over, he can find no bruise. He thinks there's no harm done. But another hidden hazard has been created. The broken cord body starts weakening the tire. It may be a week or a thousand miles later. The same car is rolling along a winding highway when suddenly the inevitable happens. Every year, more Americans die in automobile accidents than were killed in the Korean War. Why take a chance on tires that don't give you the extra margins of safety that only generals provide? Only generals are made with Nigen cord, the strongest, finest cord ever developed for tires. As steel is made from iron, Nigen is made from nylon, processed by general to resist heat, stretching, bruising, or breaking. General Nigen tubeless tires have up to 50% more cord than ordinary tires, more than twice the strength. That's why you get more safe miles with Generals than any other tire built today. Now watch this General Nigen tubeless tire test. Here's a concrete island, 10 inch curve. We'll back up and hit it at 60 miles an hour. Going so fast, he went over a second island. A curve that high is like hitting an abutment. And yet you can see there is no sign of a break inside. Even with that terrific series of shocks, there was no air loss at the rim either because of General's exclusive safety pressure lock. And the fourth big safety feature you get with General Nigen tubeless tires, freedom from flats with an exclusive self-sealing latex compound inside that seals holes as it rolls. Yes, all this famous four-way protection you'll find exclusively in the one perfected tubeless tire, the General Nigen tubeless tire. Four-way protection so vitally important on today's high-speed highways in today's high-powered cars. Think how much more protection you get for the little extra you pay for generals. Ordinary tires have a safety factor of from five to seven. The general tire with Nigen cord has a safety factor of 16.8, two to three times the strength and protection of ordinary tires. Tell me, I don't drive fast. Ordinary tires are good enough. Sure, they're good enough sitting in the garage. They may be even good enough at 35 miles an hour, if you're the only car on the road. But driving today isn't like that. If you're only doing 35 miles an hour, and the other fellow's doing 35, and you meet head on in a skid or blowout, you come together at the rate of 70 miles an hour, which is the same as driving off a 10-story building. Ever see a car go off a 10-story building? Well, we thought the object lesson would be worth it. No driver will go over with it. A stuntman will jump clear, leaving only an old IMO camera bolted to the hood, ready to shoot its last scene. The parking lot below has been cleared and roped off. Everything's ready. Let her go! When you think of what might happen, why take a chance? Peace of mind is worth a small difference in price. General Tires can save your life in an emergency. <laughs>